What's up guys, welcome to Real Beats, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make some verse melodies for your beats. Let's not waste any time, let's go ahead and hop into it. Alright, so for the sound selection, the, sound, the type of sound you want to pick is more of like thin or cold sounds. So basically sounds that don't have much bass. So like, you could pick like a piano sound, right? Those work all the time. Um, but you want to stick to stuff that have higher frequencies because it'll, it'll sound really good once you reverse it or if you have time it. Um, it won't sound really muddy so that's all i'm going to say about that i'm gonna keep it brief we don't need to go into detail let's go ahead and make our melody all right so now we're going to go ahead and make our melody um with this okay and let's grab in a scale so you can kind of see let's do let's do a d minor real quick okay we can always transpose doesn't matter too much so we're in here and you can always look up chords and stuff for this or you can, whatever melody you want to make but we can start with the root um, pretty much you could just make a chord all the way up and just kind of flesh it out a bit and then you can turn things up if you want i don't i don't really like that in there all right so now we have this little chord here right it looks like it's a lot but it's really not it's just the same notes right here but we just pulled this one up okay um so now over here now, what I personally like to do is I like to make a chord backwards and then you can you can kind of make a chord from this. if You want to like that. Um, you start pulling stuff up Then you could do something like this, right? OK, um, we can keep going really like that and you can just delete stuff that you don't like. Oh, that kind of sound good. Wait. Yeah, I'm keeping that. I like that. Yeah, I'm keeping that. I like that. Okay. Uh, and then we can probably go up. Let's pull this up. Let me see. Yeah. Okay. So this works. Pull that one up. We can keep that one in there. Um, and then over here, let's take this and we could just steal from what we already have. So we can have like a little melody that goes like this at the top. And let's see. Okay, I think I'm good with that. Um, you know, you can take things out. I kind of want this to be like standalone a little bit. I kind of like it. All right, so I'm gonna just keep it like that. All right, so this is our chords. And now all we need to do is um, actually, let's copy this over here. I want to use this for the melody. I kind of like them both. But all right, let's go ahead and make an actual melody. All right, so I went ahead and copied that sound because I like the way the chord sounded. So um, I, I wanted to use this for the melody as well. So we just got the same sound here. So I'm gonna mute these and we can copy this. And this part is easy because all you need to do is just fill this middle part in. Um, just make sure you hit back on these chords. So when you reverse it, um, you have all these cool little sounds in the middle, but it always be on beat because um, they kind of circle back to the chords so um let's just play this i think we, what are we in we're on one six beat i guess so do a little little one thirds thing here that one okay let's keep that and we could just run with this literally and just change the notes up we don't even have to really do anything different um let's keep it here let's see probably let's 
Let's delete some of these mid notes. Open this up a bit. Okay, that's a lot better. All right. Um, so over here, kind of do the same thing. Probably do like something slightly different, just so it's not the same melody the whole time. push that in just slightly all right let's try that Okay, I think that's good enough. So now we can go ahead and add whatever sounds we have left. Okay, so this is our last sound. Just something extra. You don't want it to be like so one dimensional, right? You wanna add a few little sounds in there. Um, with this one, we can just literally be basic. Probably turn some of these down a bit. that's just gonna have to do um so now what we're gonna do is add some effects to reverse this all right so to reverse this um i just added a shaver box reverse and you can of course use other effects and it's pretty simple right um and to kind of melt it together i use basically um this little preset ambient lake okay um so this is what it did i'll show it bare bones With it on all right and it kind of blended everything together and i took out some of the base um so let's move on to our next part all right so real quick i just added a new sound you don't need to do this but personally i just felt like i wanted to add a new one so i just picked this um i just thought it fit the sound selection we already have uh, so I'm gonna just add some basic. I'm not gonna spend too much time on this. We can uh, use that A. Let's see. You know what? We can just use some tricks. Let's take this, pull this over, and that should be good. All right. I, I'm not. I don't want to spend too much time on this part. So um, that's the extra sound. Um, so let's go ahead and add our drums in. All right, so now we can just do our 808. Um, so we can take one of these. Hmm, let's take this one and this one. Might be a better pattern. We can try this first. That could work. Let's see. I think we can run with that one. It's a little bit more melodic. I like that. Uh, so I am going to double these up. Okay, that's the low end. So now we can just finish this off with the drums. I don't really choose too many, just a few. Um, so go ahead and do that. 
Okay, so I went ahead and added the basic little clap. Okay, and we just add our hi-hats and this beat is pretty much done. Uh, so we can zoom in. Uh, let's find D5. Actually, we could use this. Kind of get that bounce. go up into there okay and then we could just copy this over we don't got to make this complicated um so yeah this is the beat just a quick little easy beat. Um, so let's play it. All right, and that's going to be it for this one. Hopefully you enjoy. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe for new. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.